if everyone's on their last week, then and you're all injured, then nobody's obligated to take a hook. Unless you're just fed up and you're like, oh, well, I've got another four gens to do and I can't be asked for this, so I'll just die. I'll go for it and save the others. Let them have a chance. You know what I mean? It's yeah. But, uh, you know, I know how it's done. Like, you should be sharing your hooks, sharing your protection hits, healing up. Don't use perks or toolboxes to get gens done. You don't want to get gens done fast. That's not the way to do it. You don't want to get gens done fast. That's not. It's not fun for the killer when all the gens get done super fast. It's like it's just you're being a pain in the ass because all you're doing is like you're you're practically cheating, right? So like, imagine like I pick a killer and then as soon as the match starts, it goes bing, 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 and then the gate and then the gates are open and I'm like, what? You know what I mean? You, it's bullshit. Like you're not playing the game to fucking get the gens done as fast as you can and get out. Yeah, that's not that's what you're not doing, a right? Match, is it? And then you get, like I said, you get people who just like stay. They'll they'll go as soon as the get match starts. They'll run up that gen, and they'll stay on that gen until it's done. No, right? The trick is to like, ideally, whatever amount of gens is left, five, four, three, two, whatever, right? Is to get them up around the same time, and then when the killer leaves the gen, they get done. You know, because you don't want to be like I've said. I've said it before. You don't want yeah. to be. You don't want to be on the last gen, and then you have three gens yourself, and the killer just no. All the killer needs to do is just go about the three gens. And then you're, there's no way you're getting out. You know what I mean? So. You know, you're, you're making it hard for yourself. So like the idea is, really. Don't finish any gens until you've got them all, like nearly done, and then. Yeah. Fucking go and get them done. Then you, so like. The matches. So like it's this is what I'm saying. Like yeah. so like you could, like, effectively right say like four survivors all went to one gen each at the start of the match and they had like two boxes that got the gens done like super fast and perks that got the gens done super fast right. So imagine you, you had that right, and then within the first minute, ping 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 ping, four gens are done, one gen left, and then they all go into that last gen and it goes. Ping, and then they get the gates open and leave, right? That's not what you want, because then you've got yourself in a situation where, unless you all went to the right gens and didn't three gen yourself, you're going to be the last three gen. The last gen is going to be because you there's three gens left, but you only need to get one of them done at the end, right? Because there's more gens than there are the amount you need to do. You only need to do five gens, and there's like eight on a map. Yeah. Six. Five, six, there's seven on a map, right? But you only need five of them done. So, like, unless everyone's on the same page and knows exactly what gen to go to, you don't do that. The trick is to get all or as many gens as you can up and not get them done straight away, right? But when you're ready, when you've got the fifth gen up as well, you quickly get four of them done. You know what I mean? Use your head. You got it. That's how you do it. It's not hard. Try and explain it to somebody. They don't like being told what to do, but yeah, it's really in the in the debates where they're trying to say this that, and the other. Like, yeah, yeah, but it's, that is the way you do it, man. I'm telling you now, that's the way you do it. I mean, that's the way you fucking do it. I'll show you how it's done. You'll notice, like, like I don't want to get a gen like done because the killer has perks that like make the gen regress shit tons. So I could get a gen like almost done. And then the killer kicks it. There's a gen called Pop Goes a Weasel that immediately takes off and gets 20% of the gen's progress after he's hooked someone. So I could get a gen done 99% and then he hooks someone and then he kicks the gen and it automatically goes down. So I don't want to do that, right? I like to get it started, maybe get a quarter of it done, maybe half, and then I'll move on to another gen, try and get that up to halfway. Get to another gen, get that up to halfway, get to another gen, get that up to halfway. You know what I mean? But everyone's trying to get the gens done. Once it's done, it's done. Then the killer's only got like three gens left to, f to look after. So you want to. Oh my god! Ideally, like, you don't want to do them straight away because you want. Because you, you want more than three gens for the killer to worry about. 
you you still want like seven gens for the killer to run about in. Yeah. You, all you're doing is making the map smaller for him. Right, so... Yeah, that don't sound right, does it? Mm-mm. So by doing it the way I'm saying, you still have to go around the whole fucking map and find yours. So this is a logic here. Not enough people know, and it's like nobody's telling anyone. You know, it should be common knowledge by now that that's the way you should do it, right? So look, there's a gen here, right? So first things first, if I touch this gen, the killer's gonna know I'm around about here somewhere because it's making a noise, right? So fuck it, right? Now I want to get it done a bit more than this because if a killer kicks it now, it's gonna lose. It's gonna lose yeah. that, right? So yeah. I want to get it at least like that much. So even if it does kick it, I still have a bit of progress, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. But I'm not gonna stay on it, right? Here's his heartbeat. I'm gonna see him coming up the stairs because there's only one way up, and I'll get out of that window before he gets up here. But you might hear the gem. I can get away quick enough. Anyway, he's chasing him, so it's fine. So get out, done a little bit more, and then that was about the point you want to fucking leave the gen. Right? It doesn't hurt to stay on for a little bit longer. Whoa! He's pissing about. Now let's see what he does. Right, because I want to get back on that gen because it's went down a bit. See that lamp sticking out the wall in yeah. there? That's weird. See, when I'm the killer, and then it goes ping, ping, like in the first minute. See there, that's a big mistake. No. He, what he's done is he's got a gen done out within the first fucking two minutes. And already the marks are getting smaller, right? So, you leave the gen like that. You shouldn't be fucking finishing the gen. Simple as that. Because then it puts pressure on the killer to kill you. Right? Yeah. And that just, it's not a fun game when that happens. Now he's going to want to be killing us because he's scared that the gens are going to get done. They're going to get done regardless, but they're not getting done yet. See, now it's time for me to take a protection hit because... Whoa, the camera's stuck. I'm going down to Chinatown. Yeah. What was she doing there anyway? Try to get away from him.
know, they're on my gen, they're a way to finish. You know what I mean? No, it's not, because I don't want them to finish it. This is what I'm trying to tell you. He's on a gen, and they're on my gen, which is almost done. And I don't want it done yet. Yeah? Yeah, I don't want it. But they don't know.